This facility which I'm commissioning today is the outcome of one such urban renewal program, the Aviation City Redevelopment Project at the airport enclave. It is to pave way for this redevelopment that these state-of-the-art facilities have been constructed through a public-private partnership with unique development company for our hard-working men and women of the Ghana Police Service. The facility is made up of 514 one and two bedroom self-contained flats, of which 322 have been completed and ready for occupation. These units are fitted with modern facilities and will serve as comfortable homes and afford a conducive working environment for police officers and their families. In addition to the residential accommodations, this project also provides a school with modern facilities, a clinic, an astroturf football field, a tennis court, a standby generator, a police station, a fuel filling station, a workshop enclave, and other essential amenities. This is further testimony of our unwavering commitment to provide decent accommodation and other facilities for our security personnel. Not only will this facility improve the welfare of the police officers, it will also enhance their capacity to serve our nation even more effectively. As we commission the first phase of this project, I urge the Ministry of Lands and Natural Resources, the Lands Commission and Unique Development Company to work in earnest and complete the remaining 192 housing units and other facilities that make up the second phase of the project. I've been briefed that work is also far advanced on the construction of 15 bedroom self-contained flats for the Ghana Meteorological Agency, the Ghana Airport Company Limited, and the Greater Accra Regional Office of the Driver and Vehicle Licensing Authority, DVLA. The completion of these projects is crucial to the implementation of the Aviation City Project. Once again, I want to commend all those who have worked for the success of this project. And let me mention specifically Unique Development Company Limited for partnering with government to put up these facilities for the police service and for the excellent quality of its work. This obviously is a great step towards the redevelopment of the Aviation City Enclave, which will give a positive facelift to our capital city. Let me assure you, ladies and gentlemen, of my full commitment to the realization of this project towards the Ghana we aspire. I'm confident that with God's guidance and your support, we will achieve our vision of a developed, progressive, and prosperous Ghana. Accordingly, I have the singular honor and pleasure to declare the Kwabinya Police Barracks duly commissioned. May God bless us all in our homeland, Ghana, and make her great and strong. I thank you for your attention.